Hi, good morning everybody. Today is a wonderful September 28th, Monday. Yes it is, and there's a lot going on. We even got the electrician's car back behind me too. So we got them back for now. Hopefully, get them for a couple of weeks so we can get everything done in the house. Let's go look around, see what's going on. Oh, it looks like uh, some adjustments to our frames. Not sure what's going on and what happened. So these guys are going back around. The little metal pieces hold everything in and they are primering it. And we got lots of sanding going on. Lots and lots of sanding. Our favorite thing. Alright, so looks like our electrician has been busy very much indeed so here in my garden going to be underneath it all the electrical main lines that goes into the house so it's going to be buried underneath my garden hopefully none of my roots penetrated but i don't think so because i'm just going to have my little odds and ends of this and that if i grow a tomato plant or some jalapeno plants I don't think the root system to get into this. Alright, and we have some windows going on. It actually looks like it was pulled out from over here. One of our windows that we got actually uh, looks like the truck had just bounced it around everywhere and it was all scratched up. So now they're replacing it. They're going to run all this back here to that and then it'll go back down here and then go in right here into the wall. The last video at the end of the day they brought a piece of glass that was all wrapped up. Now that piece of glass is in. So we are good, it's looking like. Alright, looks like we got some more uh, cabinetry stuff going on. Lots of cutting, trimming, and bucking. Looks like they modified it a little bit. So instead of from the drawers being all the way across, he's modifying with these little bump outs so they don't hit the door. Because originally they put the sliders in and didn't think about the little bump outs where it's going to smack into the door because the door just opens up. So I guess they're going all the way back around all the cabinets and fixing all these. Alright, I, mean, I got more painting around this little trimming area, the metal and fixing it all up. And it is starting to rain. Wonderful afternoon. Some more adjustments going on, but they're getting it done. They're rebuilding these grills for the lower window. Alright, so I think part of the electrical work is done. In my understanding, from this morning, what he was going to do is take the main line and run it into here. I think it's like a three quarter inch running underneath. Here they spliced into it, into that tube, and then it comes out right here, and they cemented it in, and then it goes up into the box, and then it does its thing inside, and then uh, it comes back down, and then runs into the house. So that's what their setup is right now. And then they're going to work on getting this electrical outlet too once they get everything in. So we're moving it up out of the way for all the water. So the washer machine that's going to be hooked up here. And then I think that's the lower one. And then the upper one's going to be for the hand washing, I guess. I, I, mean, I don't know because they're pretty close. No matter what you do, if you put that washer machine here, 
it's going to be on top of things so I'm not sure and this piece right here is a drain we're having a hard time with uh, finding a number eight royal cord two strand to go into here from the generator into the box so that's what we're working on at this point in time and we got about a week's wait before we can get that connection for the generator to our double throw switches that is right here and I think we're gonna put a box on the outside of it so just in case someone wants to you know turn our power out to the CCTVs and all our other fun stuff by climbing over right here at, ain't no one getting in it and it'll be uh, weatherproof and let the adjustments begin so he's adjusting the table right here the little desk putting a piece of wood underneath it adjusting it up so it is level okay. so it looks like it's nothing in there but it's there's something there it's level and flat I am being told it's hard to tell it didn't even look like there was tiles there I forgot it been many moons ago that that was done so it's level I guess yes one footed always got some kind of strange angles you know, look at that he got his toes all curled around there so he doesn't go anywhere He's over here adjusting the doors, making sure everything works and, and goes together. But if you notice, we have lighting going on up here. So, electrician hook them up and let the light stay on up here. We actually have like our all of our plug-ins. They're electrified, you could say. Because I don't know if you guys can all see it. But there's a light on the USB outlets in our bedroom, yes. I wonder how many people are going to be using these before we get to try them out ourselves and get them broken in or broken. Nothing like some rain. I actually was riding a scooter in this just a little bit ago. I got so... And I had no rain gear either. But I just pushed through it, came home, had to do something at our farm lot. But it is really, really coming down. You can really tell from the neighbors' roof. It's not even four o'clock, I don't think yet. We came here early trying to get a, get around the rain, but we got a little bit. Um, we'll see how long this lasts. All right, good morning, everybody. Today is a wonderful second part of our video and it is Tuesday September 29th almost the end of uh, the month we're getting close but uh it looks like the house needs a lot more work than one month's worth of labor on this place so I know the electricians here and he is busy 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 so let's go see what everybody else is doing including the electrician oh I got four people up there trying to fit Yay. our prison bars on our main window for the stairs and it's a bit tight I think they're gonna have to break out the little thingy to sand it down to get it in all right and more cabinetry work going on right here some cuttings trying to get everything cut out for the drawers he's scoring it with the razor blade Oh, uh, yes. Because our main electrical line coming in. Now he has to take that all the way up to the top. 
and it is heavy duty. Mm, what size is that wire? 22mm. 22mm is the size of our wire. So, wow, you got a twist in it. So there's a bit of a twist in these wires is what's going on and he's struggling with trying to get the last little bit and hopefully they don't kink it but I don't think so I think they'll have it right here in a second the boss man's coming oh. <laughs> and they got it hooked in here so and actually see what's going on so this is gonna be the end line this is the one coming from outside and goes up into here connects in on this breaker and then the jumper is down here between the two so another line is going to come in on top for the generator and then uh, on the bottom is going to be going both of them will connect and go down into the house so that's our double throws it's got it all drawn out on the bottom of it so if you ever open it you'll know exactly what wire goes to where and we have a little stencil maker so we we got one so for multiple different things that we have we will be labeling other stuff like that so some technical difficulties with it i think they uh, broke a couple of welds and everyone forgot that we have actuators to push the windows out up here and uh, the way these bars are set up there's no room for the actuator to set inside on the inside of these uh, wonderful bars and it actually has to mount up to the, the framing of that window right there to be able to push out the window so let the fun begin because uh, the actuator is on its way here so we can adjust and figure out how to do this and we got more wonderful tiling going on in here and our little entertainment room is actually going to be the baby's room whenever he pops out no we don't know uh, I'm just wishful thinking for a wonderful bouncing baby boy but you know wise tells they say it's gonna be a, another bouncing baby girl it's another for me but not our first for I sell and I maybe I'll have to make it a tomboy <laughs> but anyways we got this going on we got our little tiles it's slow going uh, these guys had a rough time up here with these tiles for some reason probably two three well three Three, four days behind because of hollow areas underneath all these tiles. So this actually should have been done by now. All the tiling up here. Ah, the setup. The scaffolding. Why they paint all the metal up here. All the painting. So I'm hoping they're going back behind and sealing some of this because some of this stuff actually needs to be still sealed up. We got leaks here and there. My understanding is that somewhat sealed. I mean, some of it you can see uh, they have sealing on it, but there's places that we still got leaks. And in fact, I don't know if you guys can see it. No, but right up in there, there's a an actual like spot where you can see where the water's been dripping down. So I know somewhere in there, there is it's not completely sealed up. Oh, look. And got him sanding it's not too bad. and it's only on three legs he's sitting one this one leg here is not even touching the ground so let the fun begin every time he moves it wobbles <laughs> For me to have a good thing yeah all right and these are actually all of the drawer front the pulling part on all the drawers for the house he got all the sizes measured them all up and now he's he cut them out and now he's fine-tuning them and he'll be installing them I would suspect tomorrow they'll be all done looking at that they're using that main electrical light 
the wire to hold up all the CCTV for the area. It's not our CCTV, it's our contractor's uh, CCTV uh, cable. So I wonder how that stress on that pulling down with all the wires up in that ceiling and how that's going to hold all together. So the electrician was really busy today. So it looks like he's got most of this all wired in and rewired. I know they're closing off this one and then moving it all the way up here. But also they cemented in everything down here where all, everything is going to go in. And I'm reading a note and it says temporary supply energized. So that means they hooked up the power from the street going into here. The only reason why the generator ain't connected up is we gotta wait five days to get our special wire for our generator to go into our box. No one seems to have it. They have like a, a number 12 wire, but we're looking for a number 8, 8 mm wire. That's all we're waiting for. And this actually will be completed. This section will be for our generator. They just gotta fill it in and secure everything up. Everything else in here in the ground is done. I guess he'll be uh, closing the capping all this all this stuff off in here and then we have our little drain here that still needs to be done but there's quite a bit of stuff going on in here looks like the tile over here in the corner is all fixed got a little bit more to go we're hurting for bodies I don't know what happened but we have the the wood guy and it sounds like we have the plumber here. Other than that, the electrician's gone. I'm not sure where everybody's at. I'm gonna go look for him. I still asking questions now. So, there isn't very many people here. There's just three people here at the house working this afternoon. Um, our old foreman, Cuyatoto, his daughter passed away unexpectedly uh, a couple days ago, actually yesterday from a stroke so everybody went to pay their respect so i think today maybe tomorrow it will be uh, pretty dead around here we'll see how how things goes it's very understandable i got plumbing stuff going on and some tilings oh look at that they lowered it it's a drop there is a drop. So, trying to get a little second ago. I got this nice little lip here so the water won't come out. I know it needs to come up a little bit. Or go down, however, he's going to do it. I'm not sure, but talking about tiles right now, we are short one box of these big tiles. But, uh, Oh. Not sure what's going on. We got some over here, and that is what we have left for tiles right there. Not much. All right, so not much going on. All right, everybody. I hope y'all enjoyed our wonderful video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed, and hit that button down there in the corner to get notified. The next time, put out a video. Thank you and goodbye.